Reggie helped us when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. Why didn't he go with you guys when you left? I think maybe he was supposed to, but then he fell, and everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. Alright, hey everybody, this is Vivacious Vani. We're playing The Walking Dead Season 2. I recently played episode 3 and 4 thinking it was recording, only to realize that it didn't. So, we're starting at episode 3, and I'm gonna see if I can get the rest of the entire season of season 2 done today. So that way I can put it up for you guys. Wait, not- oh wait, that's still chapter two. Here we go guys, let's start. Up, moth. If you if you move slowly, I bet you can let it rest on your finger. Oh, oh that's too bad. You about done over there? Hey, fuck off. Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're friends. Friends look out for one another. We are, aren't we? Well, if you need to pee, let me know. I'll keep look out for you, too. Thanks. Uh, okay. I wouldn't like it if I was out here alone with these fuckers. Everything come out all right, girls? Please don't ask that. Troy, get them tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carve her out. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Hey, how about you fuck off? How about Has that? anyone ever taught you that? I know. <laughs> no, stop! Fuck don't shit. hit my don't... friend! You don't want to test me, girl. I'll pass every time. Leave her alone! Tie her up and throw her in with the rest of them. <laughs> Fuck Carver. He dies. Ian. Are you guys okay? No! The hell did he do to you? Hey! Did he hurt you? Hey! Hey! Fuck that guy. I 
guess we chillin' then. Alright, we gotta do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? What the hell is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. Like what? What do you mean, like what? Something sharp, anything that can help, a fucking... I don't know, anything! We're in a fucking precarious position here! We gotta do something about Settle that! Settle down, Kenny. I didn't say no, everything. I just said like, what? We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, 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 now he's fucking Bill? Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, I ain't a boy. No, right. You're a man. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. What do you mean, worse? He's a fucking psychopath now. You have no idea what you're dealing with. Oh, he gave me a pretty good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. Oh. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. Uh, we have to do something. Kenny, right, Kenny, you can't reason with him. Oh shit. Jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever been a prisoner? Kenny's right. We have to do something. We can't just sit here. How is it the kid is the only one that sees what's going on here? Clem, the adults are talking. Is that what this is? All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> there, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. No, it won't. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. If he was gonna do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. Luke will help us. Oh, yeah? When? After that crazy fucks killed us all? I'm sure he's doing his best. God hey, damn. Look, Clem. We're close. Okay, let's do this. They have guns. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm gonna punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm gonna take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Um... Hey, Clem, look at me. You trust me, right? Kenny, please, just, just listen to them. They know him. Right. What he's capable of. Yeah, okay. I trust you. I'll, I'll do what I can. All right. It's okay to be a little scared, but we gotta do this. All right. Everybody ready? Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? <laughs> Is he okay? I did everything I, I could to so. help. I trust oh, you. <laughs> Your dumbass plan. That's what hit you in the fucking face. Goddamn brakes ain't working for shit. All right, up and at him. The fuck? How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Now, I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, it might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. So be patient with them until it does. And take solace in knowing that they're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, betrayal, hate, they're all valid. Uh, no I one needs think to one person I hate. Did, but we do have to find it in our hearts to Carver. forgive them. 
Look how much food they have. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. Well, I'm hungry, motherfucker. As many of you already know, a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on, we Can need you for something. Can it wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. Turn our way. It's nothing we can't handle. I need him. I need my dad. I I can't. He's he looks after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. The expansion project. He'll be back. When? I don't know, but he will come back. Thanks, Clem. I'm sure Carver would and make sure that he's back, if not just to display the body no as a power display. So, make you know, sure he'll be back. The fence. Bill can say no if you're messing enough. with it. Just to survive, it's our obligation to make this community a beacon of hope. Thanks, Barney. Yep. To provide a light, a bright light, bright enough to shine in all this darkness. No, it's so that what we'll do. Y'all best get some rest, because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold, but at least I'll be comfortable. Hey, guys. Richie! <gasps> I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. Would you though? This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should. Say Reggie helped us you, but when we ran away. So I know. I feel the same way. Why didn't he go with you guys when you left? I think maybe he was supposed to, but then he fell, and everybody kept running. I know he had both his arms then. Oh. So basically, they got me working outside. They'll betray your own office. Lurker snuck up on me while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. That's awful. I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Why? Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. He's about fine. to. No, you won't. Let's see what he wants. You're definitely hey, not going to come back. Oh, hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. All right, let me introduce you. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey. Uh. Hello. Who are you? Uh. This freaks you out. My name's Clementine. It's very it's nice to meet you, Clementine. Thing. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? Pete's dead. Can you guys save it for the morning? Some of us gotta be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired. But, like I said, he saved my life, so... I put up with that shit. Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you were all caught, he'd let me rejoin the group, so... I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that. But... I'm not happy about it. Why oh, sure. is she off by herself? Hmm? Who? Her, over there. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, Everyone so was she's real fucking obvious weird. About where they they found her sneaking around outside the camp, covered in guts and just, like, the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie, 
No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. No, it won't be. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? We just came well, from a place we with just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. We were making our own community. We Look, I've made mistakes, him. and he's forgiven me. Carver killed my friend Walter. Okay, I, I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his reasons. His, his reason is he's a crazy piece control. of shit. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. Okay, sure. <sighs> Thank you. It means a lot. She don't speak for all of us. No, but if she doesn't want to cause trouble, she doesn't have to. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. He's drunk on that Kool-Aid. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. No, we're not. <gasps> I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Man, fuck that guy. <laughs> I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I think he's just scared. Everybody's scared. Ain't an excuse to sound like a nutcase. You're you gotta take a look around. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Well, what should I be looking for? Stuff that they don't want us to know about. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Alright. So long as I don't make noise, I should be fine. First thing Walker I just snuck up on you, huh? Yep. I was, uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking, there's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. Reminds me of the jewelry store. Shadow, it Fuck. moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. That's when it got me. Can't believe you survived. <clears throat> I can't either, honestly. But Mike killed the walker, then took off the arm really quick, like he'd done it before. Some two or three swings, but... Still alive. I still think he got higher than he needed to, but what are you gonna do? There's those things. Ouch. Don't so worry, if you put a napkin over it or like a jacket or something, you'll be fine. Ended up turning anyway. Yeah, like I said, it felt like Mike had done it before. Get a tourniquet on me real quick. This hard. place seems pretty secure. I'm just looking at everything possible. So looks kind of crappy. A name like Reggie. Kenny. What? What? I'm just asking. The hell? No, it's okay. It's not my real name. Well, my first day in the U.S. Well, out with it. Do you see any way out of here? Yeah. The fences seem pretty strong. Yeah, they do. All right. A whole house full of building supplies. I guess it ought to be. Dad! All right, go the fuck to sleep. I'm shooting the first one of y'all I see wandering around before sunup. Troy, where's Alvin? Everybody get to bed. 
That just means that Alvin is dead. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? Uh, I guess. It's your decision. I'm ready. Of course I am. Good, good. Confidence is good. You gotta have the right attitude. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. The fuck? Don't kick me. That's right. It's rude. Bitch. Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. All right, well, you better keep your fucking feet to yourself this time. Wave that gun around me. You think I- you think I give a fuck? There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning. But that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. Yes, it No, does. we're monitoring the situation. Now... There are some folks might be sore about what happened, and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. <laughs> For you. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here. Forgiveness, by proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. Fucker. Reggie, you're nearly back in. Keep following the path and we'll welcome you back with open arms. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example I'm to you all. I'm so tired. Salvation is available, but it I didn't even must be earned. It. Pay attention. Kenneth will be we'll taking over later. Reggie's okay. duties outside okay. the wall. Okay, yeah, sounds good. Michael will continue on I showing just his it was value. Nice to finally... Carlos! Oh, Lord. Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm sorry. I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. S I'm sorry, sir. No, no. That ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. You discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that One I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. My... I'm not sure with my hand that I... Well, could... that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on! Not some namby-pamby thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do it for you. I don't think you want that. He can be... Overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. No! Please! She won't do it again. Hey, no one's fucking talking to you! Why don't you shove that Unless you want ass. one of what she's about to get, I'd pipe down, Missy. I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Do it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Sarah. Stop! You're not cuddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to work. God damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. Can you, like, shut the fuck up, Troy? And you, Carver. I hope someone You're working in the armory. Me. Follow me. Tabby, you Soil, coming up! God damn this thing. Oh, shit. Clementine! Yeah? What? Who's this? She's one of the new people. She was with Carlos and Sarah. Uh, and... Sarah? I wish she'd stayed gone. She's had a hard time, Becca. Dude, so have we. 
We're not sitting on the ground like babies. Dude. Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. We're loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. Yeah, you fucking do. I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. You but are. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. That's because it's your fault. You led them to us. If I could change it, I would. I promise you. And I should believe you now. All I know about you is that you're a liar. I understand you're mad at me, and you've got every right to be. But I wanted you to know I regret my part in all of this. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. How was your first night in the yard? I know it ain't so comfortable, but it's safe. I was hungry. They didn't feed you? Bill said you'd eat every night. I haven't well, he's eaten a liar. since yesterday. I... I don't have anything. I'm sorry. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. But you attacked them instead? Hey, I didn't attack anyone. Bill did all that. I didn't want... I wasn't expecting any of that to happen. I just wanted everyone to be safe. Out there ain't exactly all flowers and rainbows. Oh, yes, yeah, so that's why you I justified not people. going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take the situation with the herd. That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. I there would if one. I knew where it was. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. Oh yeah, he'd just go around beating I'm children. not defending what he did. That was... <sighs> he killed Walter. Only to protect his own people. No, he Kenny didn't. could have killed us all. But he didn't. Bill overreacted. He was in the heat of the moment, and he overreacted. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads, and Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Probably not. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. It begins! It begins! Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Think it might be for scan. It's... Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's, it's Clum, cool. the by disaster. Like well, I'm glad. I thought it was cute. It was foreshadowing. I don't know what you think. That's you better what watch was. yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. Episode four. I mean.